How you doing, Rose Dave? I was looking for you all over. Buddy, thank yes? you for coming up here and thank you so much that you're checking on me because of, well, everyone, we, I am here at my attic. So this is my AC unit and then this is the dripping pan. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, you know, summer or spring's coming. Mm -hmm. So this is what I'm talking about. The dry, the dry, yes. the dry water. Yes. We need to suck that. Look. Home preventive maintenance is a must. If you neglect or put off inspections on the equipment in your house, you will pay dearly for it. As they say, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. The HVAC unit in the attic requires periodic cleaning as the drip pan underneath. It corrodes and the flakes of rust can clog the drain line. If the drain line is clogged, water will overflow and ruin our ceiling and this can cost a lot of money. You can see the corrosion building up on the drip pan and I have to scrape it off as best as I can. Having a vacuum helps a lot as it saves time. <laughs> oh my god, look, look at what wow, I got. Wow, Marie. You see? Wow. Okay. You see? Overflow, and it goes right here. Underneath, it's my kitchen. So I'm trying to fix this problem. I don't want to have a trouble because this is very expensive if, if something happened. So I'm doing it. And I want you to show you guys like that. So look at this, Marie. This is wow. what I got. Actually, this is my second batch. This one came up underneath. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to vacuum this. Okay. Maybe I'm going to use paper to get it. Okay. Like that. I'm, I, I'm trying to be careful with this uh, wire right here. Come on, yes. I'm going to show you. So everyone, this is a um, tip for you guys to save your AC unit, to save your house. Because this one, this is not a joke, look. And this is expensive it, to, to yep. somebody come and do it? Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. And, yeah. Actually, I already got one right here, Marie. Look. Okay. It's already... Oh, wow. Oh, mm. All that is inside in there? Yeah. Oh, my God. That's amazing. Who's going to know? And who's going to do this one? So, ladies... This is my technique. Yes, amazing yeah. job, Lee. Yes, I can. I'm do very this. proud of you, Rosie. Uh huh. Thank you. It's amazing. You do a wonderful job, guys. Please do something like this in your house to be safety when your air condition come out to in this in this summer. So what she's doing is. It's a great job. Summer coming. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I think that'll be all for now. And uh, I hope you guys learned something for today. Mm -hmm. That this is how it looks like when the water got dry. Thank you for sharing us, Rose Day. You're welcome. And let's, I'm going to vacuum more okay. to make sure 
There's nothing left. And I'm here to support her. I have a question, Rose Day. My question is, what kind of equipment do you need for these uh, views? They need to clean this, uh, this project. I know I saw you with gloves, mask. When you're working in the attic, you should wear personal protective equipment, gloves, safety glasses, a dust mask are necessary. A towel to prevent dust clouds from swirling around you will also help. The only tools I need are a putty knife to scrape the rust off, a shelf vacuum or a dustpan with a small brush. And make sure to drink plenty of water because it can get hot in the attic even though it is winter. Okay, somebody with you, so don't yes. do it lonely. Not only that, it's at least someone's watching me up here. If something happened to me, <laughs> no one's gonna know, right? Yes. Because up here, see that? Mm -hmm. This is huge. This is very huge. Yep. So just be careful, guys, okay? Like Rose Dave say, do something economic for your pocket and do it. You see, you can do it yourself. Go ahead. All righty. Thank you for watching, viewers. Bye. Bye. I love you guys. Man, it's so clean. Ready for the summer. Let's go. We're done. And then this one, we need to clean it. After use, of course, we have to clean. Because this is powder. Look. See that? So yes. I have to use this thing like sanitizer. And oh, this is this is kind of scary. Yeah. So this is Mister Clean uh, sprayer, mm -hmm. and we will rinse it there. Okay. Oh wow! This is a, a project. <laughs> Make it something fun. Let's go. Every time we use our vacuum at home, we have to wash and sanitize.